butterfly feeders, butterfly houses, butterfly books, everything you wanted to know about butterflies coming up next on The Garden Gate. Hi, I'm Brenda from the Avant Garden Shop and welcome to another episode of The Garden Gate. Today we're going to talk about attracting butterflies to your garden. There's lots of things you can do, including planting lots of nice flowers that they're attracted to, and even feeding them with butterfly feeders. So I'll explain that first. So the butterfly feeder um, works very similarly to a hummingbird feeder. You put a sweet sugar liquid into them, and the uh, butterflies will come and feed through the little holes with their proboscis, or suck from these little wicks. They can also get liquid out of there. And on these little corner pieces, you can actually put fruit. So a little piece of banana or an orange, something like that. And the butterflies will come and eat from that and drink from that. Um, it's a lot of fun to watch the butterflies and to see all of the different butterflies that you might get in your garden. The monarch is obviously one of the most uh, familiar. There's uh, viceroys and swallowtails and all kinds of different uh, butterflies. And um, they like certain types of flowers. So flowers like uh, tubular flowers that they, uh, that they can get the, the nectar out of. Or umbel type flowers, which are very flat type flowers, like the uh, Queen Anne's lace, that sort of thing. Um, they love purple cone flower. There's all kinds of different flowers, and I actually have a list on my website, so if you're interested, check that out. But it's a lot of fun to uh, watch the butterflies come to your garden. So it's important in your garden to uh, have a variety of flowers for the butterflies as well. Have blooms that continue throughout the summer, so not just one plant, but a whole variety of plants. Um, here you can see the uh, lantana that the butterfly likes in that umbel-shaped flower, as they call it. Echinacea, they love that. Um, the butterfly weed is also a really great, obviously by the name, a really great flower, beautiful orange flower that the, uh, the butterflies just love. Um, Joe pie weed is a native plant that they really love as well. And um, just a whole variety of uh, butterflies, the m or, sorry, a whole variety of plants. The more variety, the better. And you also have to think about what the caterpillars are going to eat, because the caterpillars have to live in your garden. and um, eat and then eventually they turn into a butterfly. So um, think about what plants the caterpillars like as well as what the butterflies will get the nectar from. And uh, avoid pesticides obviously because as soon as you start to kill off any insects or kill off the caterpillars then um, you'll have less chance of having the butterflies in your garden. So I hope you learned a little something about butterfly gardening and if you'd like to learn more like I say visit my website avantgardenshop.com and on my blog, I have uh, all the details that you need on setting up a beautiful native flower garden for your butterflies. Thanks again for joining me on The Garden Gate, and we'll see you next time. The Garden Gate is brought to you by the Avant Garden Shop, your destination for gardening accessories and backyard birding supplies.